It was a very wet commute for Melbourneians this morning, as overnight thunderstorms brought up to 18 millimetres of rain to 9am. That's the heaviest downpour in five months, and welcome respite from a very dry quarter. Not only were pedestrians battling to avoid soggy socks, but cars also had difficulty, as roads became waterlogged. Lightning caused disruptions to parts of the V-Line network, and buses were brought in to replace these services. This wild and wet weather isn't sticking around though, with things really heating up later in the week, as Josh Fisher from WeatherZone explains. For the remainder of the day, this low pressure trough is going to remain over southeastern Australia, creating unstable conditions, so we still have a risk of thunderstorms in Melbourne through the afternoon. But as the week goes on, we'll see a northerly wind developing. And this is going to drag hot air from the nation's interior right into southeastern Australia, so pushing those temperatures up to 36 degrees by Thursday before a change moves through later in the week.